Picture a world without high-speed computing, advanced gaming graphics, or cutting-edge artificial intelligence. Hard, isn't it? Well, we owe a lot of these marvels to a little silicon powerhouse called the Graphics Processing Unit, or GPU. And when we talk about GPUs, one name leaps to the forefront, NVIDIA. This tech giant has not only revolutionized the gaming industry, but has also planted its flag firmly in the realms of AI, high-performance computing, and much more. Their secret weapon? A unique blend of CUDA cores and VRAM, working together to deliver unmatched performance and efficiency. These components have become the backbone of NVIDIA's GPU technology, enabling us to process complex computations, render stunning graphics, and break new ground in AI. So, are you ready to dive into the world of NVIDIA and its GPU technology? Let's get started. In the heart of every NVIDIA GPU, there's something called a CUDA core. But what exactly are these cores and what do they do? Well, CUDA cores are the fundamental computational units of the GPU. Think of them like the brain's neurons, but for your graphics card. They are designed to handle hundreds of tasks simultaneously, embodying the principle of parallel processing. Now let's tackle the term CUDA. It's an acronym for Compute Unified Device Architecture, a proprietary technology developed by NVIDIA. This technology allows software developers to tap into the computational power of the GPU, previously the exclusive domain of the CPU. So how do CUDA cores work? Imagine you're in a huge stadium and you're the only one tasked to find a specific seat number. It would take quite a while, wouldn't it? But what if you could split that task among thousands of people? Each person would only need to look at a small section, drastically reducing the time it takes to find that seat. That's the essence of parallel processing, and that's what CUDA cores excel at. When it comes to complex computations, especially those involving graphics and data science, the more CUDA cores, the better. Each core isn't particularly fast on its own, but when you have thousands of them working together, they can process vast amounts of data with astonishing speed. This makes NVIDIA GPUs perfect for tasks that require high computational power, such as 3D rendering, deep learning, and scientific simulations. The CUDA cores can speed up these tasks by breaking them down into smaller, manageable tasks that can be processed concurrently. But remember, CUDA cores aren't the only factor that determines the performance of a GPU. Other aspects like clock speed, memory bandwidth, and architecture also play significant roles. However, they work in tandem with CUDA cores to deliver the high-speed, high-quality graphics we've come to expect from modern computers. So in essence, CUDA cores are the workhorses of the GPU, accelerating your graphics and computations. Their ability to process multiple tasks simultaneously is what sets GPUs apart from other types of processors, and it's what makes NVIDIA's technology so revolutionary. Now let's talk about another key component of the GPU, the Video Random Access Memory, or VRAM. To understand the role of VRAM, think of it as the backstage crew in a theater production, working behind the scenes, ensuring everything runs smoothly. At its core, VRAM is a type of memory used to store all the data that a GPU needs to carry out its functions. This includes everything from textures and lighting to the 3D models used in your favorite video games. By storing this information close to the GPU, VRAM allows for quicker access to data, leading to faster and smoother graphics performance. Imagine you're an artist with a palette. The more colors you can fit on your palette, the more options you have to create your masterpiece without going back and forth to your paint supply. VRAM functions in a similar way. The more data it can store, the less often the GPU needs to fetch data from slower sources, like your computer's main memory. But VRAM is not just about quantity, it's also about management. VRAM organizes data in a way that makes it easily accessible for the GPU. It anticipates the data the GPU will need next, ensuring that the GPU is never left waiting. So, VRAM is like the GPU's personal assistant, keeping everything it needs close at hand. This not only boosts the GPU's performance but also enhances your experience, whether you're gaming, designing, or just watching a high-definition video. Over the years, NVIDIA's GPU architectures have evolved significantly, each bringing new advancements to the table. The journey began with the Tesla architecture, NVIDIA's first unified shader architecture, which marked a big leap forward in GPU performance. With hundreds of CUDA cores and support for parallel processing, Tesla set the stage for the GPU revolution. Next came the Fermi architecture, stepping up the game with over three times the number of CUDA cores compared to Tesla. Fermi also introduced concurrent kernel execution, allowing for even more efficient parallel processing. 
Additionally, it brought about improvements in VRAM, with faster memory and better error correction capabilities. However, the true game-changer was the introduction of the Ampere architecture. Ampere pushed the boundaries with an astonishing number of CUDA cores, reaching into the thousands. This massive increase in core count led to a significant boost in computational power, enabling more complex and detailed graphics than ever before. The Ampere architecture also saw substantial enhancements in VRAM, with faster memory speeds and larger capacities. But the evolution of NVIDIA's GPU architectures is not just about increasing the number of CUDA cores or boosting VRAM. It's also about improving efficiency. Each new architecture brings with it optimizations that allow for more efficient processing, reducing power consumption and heat output, while delivering better performance. Moreover, NVIDIA's GPU architectures have had a profound impact on technology as a whole. They've enabled advancements in fields as diverse as artificial intelligence, scientific research, and of course, gaming. By providing the computational power needed to handle complex algorithms and render detailed graphics, NVIDIA's GPUs have opened up new possibilities and pushed the boundaries of what's possible. These advancements have not only improved GPU performance but they've also opened up new possibilities in the tech world. From powering the most demanding games to driving breakthroughs in AI and scientific research, NVIDIA's GPU architectures have truly revolutionized the technology landscape. And with NVIDIA continuing to innovate, we can only expect more amazing advancements in the future. One of NVIDIA's most significant contributions has been in the field of AI, thanks to their Tesla GPUs. No, the Tesla architecture in NVIDIA's GPUs is not related to Elon Musk or his company Tesla Motors. NVIDIA's Tesla GPU architecture is named after the physicist and inventor Nikola Tesla. These aren't your typical gaming GPUs. Tesla GPUs are designed specifically for high-performance computing and artificial intelligence applications. These powerful processors are tailored to handle the intensive workloads that come with machine learning and deep learning. They're packed with thousands of CUDA cores which allows them to perform many calculations simultaneously, a feature that's absolutely crucial for AI applications. But it's not just about raw power. Tesla GPUs also come with specialized features that give them an edge in AI. They're equipped with tensor cores designed to accelerate deep learning tasks and high-capacity VRAM for handling large data sets. This combination of features allows Tesla GPUs to deliver outstanding performance in AI tasks, from natural language processing to image recognition. Tesla GPUs aren't just hardware. They're part of a larger ecosystem that NVIDIA has created for AI. This includes software like CUDA, which allows developers to program these GPUs and tap into their power, and platforms like NVIDIA's DGX systems, which are purpose-built for AI workloads. In a nutshell, NVIDIA's Tesla GPUs represent a significant leap forward in AI technology. They've given researchers and developers the tools they need to push the boundaries of what's possible with artificial intelligence. Tesla GPUs have revolutionized artificial intelligence, bringing us one step closer to the future. But NVIDIA GPUs aren't just about CUDA cores. They also feature tensor and ray tracing cores. You see, the architecture of NVIDIA's GPUs is like a well-conducted orchestra with different types of cores playing different roles. Let's start with CUDA cores, the workhorses of the GPU. CUDA cores are responsible for performing the computations required by a GPU. They are designed for parallel processing, meaning they can handle many tasks simultaneously. This is especially useful when dealing with complex computations or large data sets. But CUDA cores aren't the only players in this technological symphony. Enter tensor cores. These cores are specialized for machine learning tasks. They accelerate large matrix operations which are the heart of neural networks. Tensor cores are like the quick-thinking maestros, conducting computations at a speed CUDA cores alone could not achieve. Now let's talk about the artists of the group, the ray tracing cores. These cores are designed to render realistic lighting and shadows in 3D environments. They do this by simulating the physical behavior of light, a process that is computationally intensive. Thanks to ray tracing cores, video games and digital animations are entering a new era of photorealism. However, these cores don't operate in isolation. They work together harmoniously to deliver the power and performance we associate with NVIDIA GPUs. CUDA cores handle general computations, tensor cores take on machine learning tasks, and ray tracing cores bring visuals to life. Each core type has its own strengths, and when combined, they form a versatile and powerful tool. 
This collaborative function makes NVIDIA's GPUs capable of handling a diverse range of tasks, from gaming and graphic design to scientific research and artificial intelligence. So, each type of core has its own role, but together they make NVIDIA GPUs the powerhouses they are. So, how is a GPU made? Before a GPU's design is etched onto a wafer, it originates from a process called chip design, or integrated circuit design. This involves creating the layout and functionality of the GPU using specialized software. Engineers design the microarchitecture, determining how the transistors will be arranged and how they will function together. This design is then converted into a photomask, which is used in the photolithography process to etch the design onto the silicon wafer, creating the actual GPU. This process involves intricate planning and precision engineering to ensure the functionality and efficiency of the final GPU product. The design is then etched onto the silicon wafer in a process known as photolithography, a marvel of precision engineering, which then undergoes a series of treatments including ion implantation and thermal oxidation to form the transistors. Each transistor, a mere nanometers in size, acts as a switch controlling the flow of electricity and ultimately the GPU's operations. So, what does the future hold for GPU technology? The evolution of GPU technology has been nothing short of phenomenal, and it doesn't show any signs of slowing down. As we look towards the future, we can speculate on some exciting developments that could revolutionize the way we interact with technology. One such development is the rise of quantum computing. While still in its infancy, quantum computing promises to exponentially increase processing power, which could unlock new possibilities for GPU technology. If NVIDIA can successfully incorporate quantum computing into their GPUs, we could see a seismic shift in computational capabilities. Another possible advancement is the integration of AI into GPUs at a more intrinsic level. While GPUs are already heavily used in AI applications, future GPUs could come with AI capabilities built directly into their architecture. This could lead to more efficient processing, lower power consumption, and even the ability for the GPU to learn and adapt to specific tasks. We also can't ignore the role of GPUs in the ever-expanding field of virtual reality. As VR becomes more mainstream, the demand for powerful GPUs capable of rendering immersive, lifelike environments will rise. NVIDIA is likely to continue pushing the boundaries in this area with GPUs that can support ever more complex VR experiences. In terms of raw power, we can expect future GPUs to continue the trend of increasing core counts and VRAM capacities. This will allow for even smoother performance and the ability to handle more complex tasks. However, it's not just about power. Future GPUs will also need to be more energy efficient, as the demand for environmentally friendly technology continues to grow. Finally, we should consider the potential for more specialized GPUs. Just as NVIDIA has developed GPUs specifically for AI and high-performance computing, we could see GPUs tailored for other specific tasks or industries. This could include GPUs optimized for data analysis, scientific research, or even specific types of gaming. The future of GPU technology is exciting, and we can't wait to see what NVIDIA brings to the table next. We've covered a lot of ground today, from CUDA cores to future trends. We kick things off with a deep dive into NVIDIA's GPU, focusing on CUDA cores and VRAM and their crucial roles in technology. We discovered how CUDA cores process complex computations efficiently, and how VRAM stores and manages data for processing. From there, we trace the evolution of NVIDIA's GPU architectures, from Tesla to Fermi, and finally to Ampere, highlighting advancements in core count, efficiency, and VRAM improvements. We also focused on the application of GPUs in AI and gaming, providing real-world examples of performance enhancements. Lastly, we speculated on what the future holds for GPU technology, discussing emerging trends and potential innovations. In essence, we've seen how NVIDIA's GPUs with their CUDA cores and VRAM have transformed the tech landscape from gaming to artificial intelligence. NVIDIA's GPU technology has revolutionized the tech world, and there's no doubt that it will continue to shape our future. Thank you for joining us on this journey through NVIDIA's GPU technology. We've delved deep into the heart of graphics processing units, unraveling the complexities of CUDA cores and VRAM, and highlighting the transformative role of NVIDIA's tech in the realms of AI and gaming, but this, my friends, is just the tip of the iceberg. The world of GPUs is vast, evolving, and incredibly fascinating. So why stop here? 
Let this be the launchpad for your exploration into the extraordinary domain of GPU technology. There are countless resources out there, from NVIDIA's own detailed documentation to a plethora of online forums, blogs, and videos. Dive in, delve deeper, and let your curiosity guide you. Knowledge is a journey, not a destination. And this journey is packed with intriguing discoveries and mind-boggling advancements. Keep exploring, keep learning, and remember, the future of tech is as exciting as we make it.